How's it going everyone? Wild Thang here and welcome to another Destiny video. So in this one I've got a new weapon to show you guys and I took it into the Crucible. Now it is an auto rifle and I've not used an auto rifle in the Crucible for ages, like months. I can't even remember the last time I used one. And this one is called the Continental. It's a Vanguard auto rifle. I got it from ranking up the Vanguard and I got a pretty sweet roll so I am happy with it. So what I've got on mine is crowd control, so kills with this weapon grant bonus damage for a short time. Perfect balance, this weapon has extremely low recoil and glass half full. The bottom half of each magazine causes additional damage. Now this thing is a beast. I love using it. I managed to get 27 kills in a game. I did lose because obviously matchmaking is just so friendly towards me and always puts me on like the good teams, obviously not. But I was using this and I loved it. I absolutely love it. It reminded me of using auto rifles in year one. You know, when auto rifles were ridiculously powerful and everyone was running around with the Zorus regime. And I remember I had my Shadow Price and also my Vanquisher from New Monarchy. Loved those guns. So it did remind me of year one and it did get me feeling a little bit nostalgic. So I wanted to upload it and show you what this auto rifle is like. And if you can get a good roll on it, Definitely try it out because it is awesome. Like, seriously awesome. Now there are quite a few auto rifles with this sort of rate of fire in the game. It's not the fastest rate of fire which is nice, it's easy to control and also if you've got lots of stability this thing can be a laser. So if you haven't got this auto rifle there are a few other ones out there that you can pick which have the same sort of stats. You've got the Dead Orbit Extremophile which has ex pretty much the same stats apart from it's got slightly more range, like one point on range more than the Continental. You've also got the Vision Stone which is the Trials of Osiris auto rifle which has more range so it's probably even better than this one. You've also got the Zuros RE41 and the Righteous 7 from New Monarchy which both have the same rate of fire but their range is a lot less it's almost half of what this one is so I, I personally wouldn't bother going for that one so yeah if you can't get a good roll on the Continental try out the Vision Stone or the Extremophile they're the best ones compared to this one you've got those three in the same sort of category so if you haven't got this one try out those two as well it can be tough using this gun in Crucible because obviously you do need to pretty much reload after every kill. Now obviously crowd control and glass half full can help trying to kill two people with one magazine. I did find that I did do that a couple of times but the second person was usually weak and I did use cover quite a lot. So just make sure you use your surroundings, use cover. If you've got two people in front of you, hide and then just kill one and then pop out and try and get the other one after reloading. Obviously gauntlets that increase auto rifle reload speed will help a hell of a lot. Not much but it still does help. As you'll see we were on the new skyline map and I was playing some control. I like playing control because I know where the enemies are going to be and it just helps me to line up my gunfights a lot better and engage with the enemy easier. Now unfortunately we did lose this match because matchmaking wasn't so kind to me, it did put me on the on a team. I mean I'm flattered that matchmaking thinks that I can carry six a six person team, but it would have been nice to actually win, especially after dropping like 5k points in control using an auto rifle. Now some people may think that this can't stack up to like the meta or the better weapons that are in the game, but don't listen to them because as, so, as long as you can use a gun, it can compete against anything. If you can use the gun well and just use your surroundings, use cover, use anything to your advantage, then you can use pretty much any weapon in the game. And I've always said like a good player can use any weapon. It doesn't matter. They shouldn't have to use like the best stuff. You should be able to use anything and I hopefully I've proved that with this auto rifle. You rarely see auto rifles in the Crucible apart from the Doctrine or just horrible guns like that that everyone hated when it first came out so it's nice to use an auto rifle and actually do well it was nice especially getting 27 kills uh, with a gun that I've never used before and on a map that I barely know so I hope that this shows that you can use any weapon as long as you get used to it throughout the game it's just it's nice to be able to use something and perform well and you should feel proud and yeah I just I just love this gun. I think I'll be using it quite a lot. I may even try using it in trials just for giggles. 
Anyway guys, I think I've done enough talking. Hopefully this gives you a little bit of an idea as to what this auto rifle is like and I hope you have one and I hope one drops for you and I hope you get a gold roll like I have. I can't imagine a better roll to be honest because this one is pretty much god tier for an auto rifle. But anyway, if you've got any questions about this auto rifle let me know in the comments below. I will be trying to get out some more weapon reviews as soon as I can with all these new weapons that we've been given with the Rise of Iron DLC. So anyway guys, I hope you have an awesome day and I will see you in the next one.